There you are, handsome. Hello, Maud. How have you been? Oh, simply wonderful. And you? About the same. Somewhere stuck between joyful and peachy. Even in this world full of scum and detritus, it's only right that we all bear our share. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Take this poor wretch. On the run, desperate, alone, about to learn the true meaning of suffering, all for a few thousand bucks. Think you can find him for me? Every man has his talents, Maud, and the rigorous administration of justice is, uh, it's one of mine. That's why I love you, Trevor. I'll send you his file. Trevor, you're still banned. What about these two? Whoever wins gets banned. <laughs> He's one, ban him. I can't ban him. He's my goddamn husband. He's young enough to be your son. Ain't the internet a beautiful thing, honey? Anyway, I Ooh. saved your husband. Now get me a drink. I got a meeting. Okay, but any more bodies turn up in my bar. I swear, I will not serve you. Mr. Phillips. Ah, uh, here he is. Yes, Mr. Chang, pleasure to meet oh, you. No, I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. <laughs> You all speak Spanish, speak it to each other! Mr. Tao Chung is uh, pleased to meet your acquaintance. Oh, yeah, he seems it. What's wrong with him? I'm out. No, don't go! Please! I beg you, if you go, his father kill me. Why do I give a fuck? You don't, but we hear that Trevor Phillips' corporation is serious business. We pay good price. Things work out, we partner, make big money. <laughs> I'm rushing! Well, let me show you the operation. This is us. Coming down to see the kitchen. You can't get here quick enough. The Aztecas are coming. They think you took out Ortega. They ain't mistaken. Well, get down here and take them out, too. You sure your boss don't want this crank for his own personal consumption? 
No, no. Mr. Cheng Sr. is very specific. He wants a good, reliable source of methamphetamine. We will buy from you here and distribute using established networks. I'm worried that might dilute what our operation's all about. Shit, Trevor! We ain't got long! Whoa, 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 whoa. Manor chef. These are our guests, all right? We got Mr. <laughs> Cheng and his humble servant. Hey, Lao uh, Shung! <laughs> nice to meet you. Trevor, we ain't got long till they get here. Everything in its time, all right. Gentlemen, please, come check out the storage facilities. Go on now. Nice, right? Oh, there whoa. you go. <laughs> Ample room inside. Mr. Cheng, please, sir, if you will. Let me out! No. Super. Tour will recommence shortly, gentlemen. Should we get the guns? Help. Yes, chef. Help me! If I knew we were having visitors, what is that little spring clean? Ortega has always been cool with us before. Please. Chinese delegation. They might be catching a chill. Hey, all right, time to recommence the tour, gentlemen. <laughs> Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! I think we have seen quite enough. Uh, I'll swing by and sign the contracts, all right? Just ignore the bodies. Hey, Trevor, are we still gonna cook that batch? Fuck yeah! Okay. You're gonna meet a bitch, that's where you're gonna meet one, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey. 
Give me a sip of that. What? Come on! My throat's dry as a motherfucker. Why? Is your mother dry when you're... <laughs> what the fuck is that, huh? Nothing. Well, it didn't sound like nothing, all right? It didn't seem like nothing. I don't think that it was nothing. So I didn't mean nothing by it, old man. Old man? Old man! Fuck you, you creepy old motherfucker. That's right. I said it. Creepy. Old! Motherfucker! No! Jesus. Huh? No, come on. Get what? Up. What? What? Sorry. Now, where sorry. were we exactly, huh? Get up. Oh. We're sorry, man. We're Help. sorry. Help! There's a guy with a gun! Go fuck yourself! Reunion! Reunion! You mother yeah. Jesus, are you it's trying to get shot? Me. Yeah. I try to be a good neighbor, and this is what I get! I'm taking out the trash, Sandy Shores!
What's going on, Ron? They were here for you. Here for you. Who was here? Them bikers. After you killed Johnny K. And they damage my stuff, huh? They smash up my home, damage my soul. This, 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 this statue here of impotent rage, this fucking meant more to me than Johnny K meant to anyone, and they smashed it. Those pathetic midlife crisis, hog riding, shaven headed, fruity leather, chapped wearing fucking assholes. They're assholes, Trevor. They are. They're chap wearing assholes. Oh, wait, 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 you little shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, <laughs> Michael fucking Townley, right? Bitch wife, two kids, 45. Find him. Los Santos is a big, big place, Trevor. There's lots of people. You are fucking useless. Huh? Find out who did that fucking robbery, all right? And if Michael Townley lives there, or anyone matching his description, I'm gonna kill you and your fucking cousin. Am I being clear now? Yes, Trevor. Thank you, Wayne. Now smile. Uh, yeah, uh -huh. all right? That's better. Run along. Uh. <laughs> now, Ron, shall we go? I cannot believe that they fucking destroyed my statue of impotent rage. The cheek, huh? The fucking cheek of it. I gotta swing by ammunition. Go to Sandy Shores Airfield, check it out. Come in! Come in! I'll come in your ear when I get a hold of you. I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high-power scope. They say they support local business. Well, we're about to find out if that's true. Melvin! How you feel about brand synergy, huh? TP Industries. That sniper on your wall looks like it'll do the job. That's the chestnut. You got a scope and a suppressor for this? There's the necessary magnification. Get that look off your face. I know you sold Cletus's gun and he ain't got three brain cells. Non-refundable, I should add. Run! Run, I got the gun. Meet me at the water tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But you gotta look out, because there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run. We're gonna wait till the right time and appropriate them. We are? Yes! We are! Where are you, man? I'm waiting at the water tower. I'm up here. I don't see the hardware. But I do see a hell of a lot of bikers. Come up! We gotta wait till you can slip in there unnoticed. Should give you the time to plan a route to the gas tank you're rigging up to blow. R really? Enough waiting. This is your moment, Ronald. Whenever you get a doubt in your mind, I want you to remember that I'm watching you through the scope of a high-powered rifle. Right, Trevor. Right, right. Got it. Now, relax. The ATV can only take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Here, by the road. You wouldn't believe this, Ron. 
One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me! That's me! Don't shoot! Well, get a move on! I'm moving! Just keep me covered, okay? Standing under the control tower! There! Good kill, Trevor! You want me to shoot you in the behind? Hurry up, will ya? Shit! I hear an engine! They're gonna see that guy you shot! Quick, shoot out the lights on the tower above him! There's one, and there's the other. You got him! Now don't shoot the guy in the van until he stops and gets out. Sailor. Can you get your sights back on me? Come on, man! You're in my crosshairs again! And there's no one left to kill, so get over to that gas tank and plant the bomb! I'm on it, but there's a guy coming out of that building, I think. I can hear him. There's another guy! Coming out of the building! Good kill, Trevor! Chopper, just fucking drive!
up, Drex! I suppose there's room for a passenger. Watch out for the bikers! They're all over you! I told my contact to meet us just off the coast. Hey, there's a biker on your wing, Trevor. I am aware of this. Well, you gotta get him off. Do a roll or something. While the man on my wing presents no immediate danger, I'll do my best to oblige you. He's still there! Trevor, you can't get him off! He ain't letting go, is he? That guy is clinging on! I thought we were going this way. Have I got the wrong cords over here? You set up a buyer for these guns already? I thought we was just hitting back at him for the thing with the statue. If you'd read our latest shareholder report, Ron, you'd know TP Enterprises has been exploring a takeover of some lost MC business in the armaments and narcotics sectors for some time. And that kind of requires someone to purchase our guns. Right, of course. But Johnny K and the figurine? Recent events, my impending departure included, have only expedited things. Trevor Phillips Enterprises is a far superior organization to the Lost Leather Club. Well, we hope we improve revenue streams, cut overheads, and maximize profit all that. <laughs> I wouldn't expect anything less. For one thing, we won't be paying a bunch of idiots to stand around in cowhide sniffing engine fumes. It's important work you do it out here. God knows, we need a sharp mind running things. I am blessed to be a part of it. That's him. Let's do it. Fort San Kudo coming up. If we fly low, we ain't gonna show up on military radar. Successfully delivered, Ron. Now remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. We're gonna make some coin from that hardware, boss. TP Enterprises are raising guidance, and the Lost MC are posting unexpectedly soft projections for the coming quarter. They're getting everything that's coming to them. A vast criminal... like the Lost MC shouldn't let a goon like Johnny K represent them. He was a man past his prime. I heard he used to be serious. Few hard stamps to the head knocked the seriousness right out of him. Sure did. But before that, I mean, back in Alderney. Man was weak for Crystal, weak for Ashley. Man was weak. Shouldn't have spoken to me like that. He shouldn't have. He was a fool. And you corrected him. He'll not do that again. Keep low, over the swamp, boss. So the guns are going to Mexico? Me 
Mexico. Yeah. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? All right, T. I think that was adequate restitution for my impotent rage statue. That was a mighty fine statue, Trev. That was a mighty fine piece of plastic shit. But there is no price for emotional attachment. I mean, you might forego your cut to uh, alleviate my heartache. I might? Yeah, I mean, I will. Good idea. We don't have time to dwell on that now. Because we got more runs, Ron. If there is one thing that they need south of that big fence, it is guns. <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Technical expertise, hmm? managerial innovations, unstoppable. Oh, that's right. Now go. I need to meditate. Or masturbate. Or both.
Hey, bud. What you do? Nothing. What you up to, Cletus? Uh, hunting. Hunt, hunting what? Retirees? Nah, just stuff. Windows, antenna, tires, vermin. Ah, so that was you. Tis the season for it. I don't give a shit about no season. <laughs> oh, good, huh? Don't let the regulations get you down. That's what I'm saying. Hey, hey, hey. You want to come hunting with me? It'd be real neighborly of you. Hell, why not? All right, then. Up here with you. I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Okay, you see them three big satellite dishes? A decent shot, and they'll go down easier than a whore's drawers. You're a real pillar of the community. <laughs> no more reality TV for you, Mrs. Gilbert. Okay, one more for the road. Yeah, boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy date, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. So, what now? We're gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? <laughs> Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. Well, we'll take your vehicle then. You've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. It's gotten so I can't even keep up with the demand no more. All this eat local, small batch, farm to table bullshit. You know, I could maybe use another pair of hands if I can get you up to snuff with that rifle. You keep on criticizing my shooting, You'll be starring in a snuff with that rifle. Here we are. I bet you never shot out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I wanna see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good, plain, old-fashioned fun. Pop the tires is much more fun. Shit for brain. That's it, beauty. And again, Trevor. Jesus. Nice. Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. Yeah, not too bad, Trevor. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. Just two fellers chilling time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything with a face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything with a face on four legs? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not neighborly. We'll get a better shot from up here. All right, I see him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. Sing to me now, song dog! And another! Dropped it like a bad habit. Hellfire! That should do it. Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Eh, uh, why not? All right, gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about.
You sure as shit are one dumb, ignorant, white trash hillbilly, Wallace. <laughs> You're damn right! <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La 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 la. Quiet <laughs> Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle weight. And I think I've proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you and me. Now give me some of that goddamn X. I'm afraid we want to go down a different path. What? We want to explore other opportunities. Shut the fuck up! Our boss, Mr. Cheng's father, wants something a little larger. We want to move drugs, perhaps guns. This is my life's work. I mean, since I was a little kid, I, I dreamt big. You know, I've always wanted to be an international drug dealer and, and a weapons trader. All right, so I'm begging you. Let's make this happen. I'm very sorry. You're sorry? You're fucking sorry? I just spilled my fucking guts out to you, and you say to me you're sorry. Who are you working with? Hmm? Who? I'm not at liberty to say. Oh, no, no, no. You're at fucking liberty. In fact, I'd say you are obliged. <laughs> who? Fucking who? 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 The O'Neill brothers. The O'Neill brothers, huh? Yeah. You shitting me? No. Because those fucking O'Neill brothers, I hear a little birdie telling me that they have a bit of a problem since one of them's going to have to be surgically removed from the skull of the other. Fuck you guys and fuck them. I just spoke to that maniac, Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect it. Right. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks? I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'll kill the lot of you, and I'll torch your cookhouse.
fucking Trevor fucking Phillips. You're all dead! You want to see competition in the marketplace? Help me out here for Christ's sake! Keep him out of the lab! In the lab! Don't come any closer, all right? You win. You can have the contract. We ain't got the ambition, man. I don't know how many... Gas in a meth lab. Oh, you're gonna burn, you idiots. Where are you gone, fuckers? Smell those fumes! Yeah, you've only yourselves to blame. You disrespectful pricks! 